Here is a tumor of the breast, which can occur anywhere in the body that has blood vessels because it's a blood vessel tumor and it's often easy to diagnose. When you look at uh, any tissue and you see that there are prominently dilated vessels, some of which contain abundance amount of blood, some of which contain perhaps smaller amounts of blood like you see here, you can be suspicious that this is a hemangioma or benign tumor of blood vessels. Notice that this tumor does not look glandular like you see in many of the breast benign or malignant tumors, but instead you see many of these little slit-like spaces lined by endothelial cells, which blood vessels should have, in which you see collections of blood. Uh, this lesion, like any hemangioma, could blanch. If you were to put force on it, the blood could go away and then slowly come back again. And uh, this is a very uh, common tumor anywhere. Often they're congenital. Uh, and uh, often the diagnosis is very, very easily suspected by just looking at the gross specimen. And you see a very red um, tumor in which there are these large distended uh, blood vessels. Uh, if these areas perhaps infiltrated or metastasized, they would be less likely to show those nice little slit spaces lined by endothelium. And uh, you could then uh, call it a uh, hemangiosarcoma, of which there are many different types. But in the classic hemangioma, you have vascular spaces of various sizes uh, lined by a nice layer here, 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 here of endothelial cells. Because a hemangioma is a benign proliferation of endothelial uh, spaces in which blood often fills them. Thank you very much.